Good morning. This is another estate sale haul. Um, this is actually a pickup my sister did for me. She knows that I'm really into canning lately, so she bid for these online, and it was a dollar for this box, a dollar for this box, and a dollar for this box. So these are all like really vintage jars. They're dirty, but they'll clean up no problem. Um, and I don't actually, as long as there's no chips in the rim right here, they can be used for water bath canning or, you know, pressure cooking canning. But I probably, I don't like canning in these big quart, um, since it's just the two of us. I plan to use these for dry goods storage, uh, you know, to store like rice in, my breadcrumbs, croutons. I might can with these if I, you know, need to can something that I have a lot of, but for the most part, I bought these or my, I plan, I didn't buy these, my sister got these for me. I plan to use these as dry goods storage, but they absolutely can be used for canned as long as the, um, you don't, there's no chips. So the reason you wanna make sure that this is perfect right here is because if there's chips in the glass, it will not seal properly. And then it, it was just not good for long-term storage. So, but it is good for dry goods. And then, so dollar, dollar, dollar. And then this flat, I think she paid a little more. Um, and she did show me ahead of time because I think she paid like $10 because this is just novelty sake. Like you can't, or I'm not going to, I'm not actually gonna use these products because these, these are old. Like this one looks good, but these are all rusted and these are all like, you know, old, like, older than me probably maybe not as old as me maybe 30 years old like um 83 cents like right now like if you were to buy one of these at the store it's like three 5.99 3.99 depending what store you are you're at um let's see if they look good they're all stuck together uh, I guess, you know, technically if I was desperate, they could be used, but I really bought these just um, for the novelty sake because this is old packaging. I'm kind of thinking I might do like a shadow box frame, you know, like how um, some people in their kitchens, they decorate it with like vintage antiques. And so this is kind of pretty much why I bought it. Just maybe I'll do some kind of vintage scene of can of canning products like Look at this, <laughs> look at this old rusty thing. This is how, you know, you take the canned goods out of the water bath canner. Um, you know, you don't really want to use it, but it looks cool and it would look cool on a, a vintage shelf where you display vintage items. So this is just a vintage box. The stuff in here looks pretty rusty. And then this brand, I haven't even heard of this brand. Ball, Ball's the most famous brand of glass jars and canning goods. This The second one is Kier. Um, that's the second most famous. And then I've never heard of this one, Bernardin. Um, let's see what's in here. Yeah, extremely rusty. So I'm not for sure. Holly technically should have won this for a dollar, but I think she did end up paying at least $10. People were bidding it up. And I don't know if they also wanted the nostalgia's sake or because they thought they could use it for canning. Definitely don't recommend using this for canning. I was hoping it would like have a, a date on it somewhere so I could tell you how old these are. I wanna say these are from the 60s, 60s and 70s. So, but I am very happy with the jars. I can't believe she only paid a dollar. Um, these, like if I were to buy a case of these, like for 12 of these at the store right now, it's like $14.95, $19.95, depending on what store I buy it at. They just need a good soap and water and then they will be good as new. So yeah, this is just another quick showing what I pick up at estate sales. This is another one where Holly bid online and then um, a local pickup. So, and then she um, brought it to my house the other day when she picked me up for a road trip we went on. So I gotta get these cleaned up because I plan on making some croutons tonight with some old bread I have. And I wanna have a couple of these cleaned up to store my croutons in. Thanks for watching. Please hit the like and subscribe buttons and I will see you later.